Hey, this is Mirgloff, and this is the Hardcore Mode Flat World Challenge. The goal is to get 80 gold ingots, to make 20 gold blocks, to make a golden minger sponge. In the previous video, I uh, renovated the uh, Flat World HQ, added a little enchanting station, screwed up this nether portal, because I did not have enough obsidian. Well, I did have enough obsidian if I just uh, did not put those cor unnecessary corner pieces, as you only need... Uh, 10 obsidian blocks to make a functioning portal, so we were going to go into nether, but not anymore. I was all prepared, but I uh, messed that up. So we're just going to pick another direction, which is going to be this way. So we're going to start finding more NPC villages. I don't know how soon I'll find the next one, so we're going to do a time lapse. Alright, found a new NPC village. Right away I can see a blacksmith. At least I'm hoping it's new, because we're in the area where I first started, where I first spawned. So, I could very well have been here already, but I don't think so. As I recall, I didn't really find any NPC villages that had chests in them when I was first starting off. So... We're definitely going to take a look, though. It would be absurd not to. And some bread. Some saplings. I mean, the saplings would have been interesting if I hadn't already had some. Because they're somewhat rare. Now let's just make sure there isn't, uh... Two... Of them? Is there no yeah, there's another one. That is good. That is fortunate. How is everyone today? Oh, gold and diamonds. I am happy today. How are you guys doing? I got diamonds. Alright. Except for it's not the adequate amount to build a diamond pickaxe and go to the nether, so we're going to have to move on. Not even enough to make gold or diamond boots. I can go another NPC village without any food or wheat. So we'll press on. Alright, another NPC village, and this one looks pretty big. I mentioned a handful of videos ago that I was hoping to find some really large ones like I've seen videos of. Although I've, uh, have heard that those videos might be fake. I don't know whether it's true or not. But, one can hope, one can dream. For a bed, that is. I would like a bed. Let's find uh, some wool real quick. I saw some sheep a little bit ago, but I'm not going to journey backwards and hopefully find sheep. When I got enough wool right here, why would I do that? That would be silly. I'm going to build a bed in this church because... Churches have been reliable and safe to me. Of course, I need a workbench. Hopefully, there won't be any monsters, so I gotta be qu build this quickly. Oh, are you kidding me? I didn't pick it up. It's madness. Come on. If I don't hurry up, there'll be monsters and mobs and they won't let me sleep. Out of my way. Okay. 
Got enough wool to make a bed. Huzzah! Whoa, what? I don't know what I was consuming, but I have woken up in the wrong place. It was him. He did it to me. Okay. I don't really need any cobblestone. And I don't know why I have these boots. I don't need those either. Yeah, there. Okay, let's go look for the blacksmith. If there is one. If there isn't, I'll just collect some wheat. Oh, it'd be weird if this was such a large NPC village, but no blacksmith. This is almost like an NPC town. It's got a little developed area right there. But no blacksmith. Peculiar. Not seeing one. Well, that's unfortunate. Guess it's just time to collect some wheat. And... Let's see... More wheat. Deal with this big slime. Get out of here. Alright. Okay. Well, there's not really... There's no blacksmith, so... That's disappointing. That's okay, I've been on a fairly lucky streak yet. There's there's the perpetrator, the missing wool block. And I don't need any wood or cobblestone. So I got that. Well, I'll get some more wheat, because I don't think this is going to amount to much more than maybe 10 pieces of bread. Let's just get rid of these guys. They're ruining all this... this wheat. Alright, I think that's enough now. Mm, not really. Well, it's fine. We'll move on. Just as soon as I reorient myself to see uh, which direction I came from. I think I came from this direction. Yes, I did. So we'll just leave the obligate... the obligatory... Uh, I should not try and say that word. Because I am terrible at saying it. That doesn't look much like an arrow, that just looks like a plus. Get out of the way. Alright. Moving ever onward to the next NPC village. Ow. Jerk. Interrupting me with pain. I probably should have made that weed into bread, but I'm going to do more time lapse to the next village. And we'll call that the last village. Alright, and this is the last NPC village that we're going to explore for the day. But before we go into both of these blacksmiths, 
we are going to take a sleep so that nothing horrible murders us. Uh, it, okay, well, it's getting there. It's, will only let me sleep as soon as the sun touches that horizon, like that. Okay, with this weird thing again. Ouch. Let's quickly explore this blacksmith. Gold? Thank you. And some iron, I'll take that. Why not? Bread as well, everything was good in that chest. We're at 13 gold ingots. Was that three ingots found in this video? Or did I find one in the last video? I know I found one with uh, some diamonds. Is, is there anything ever in here? I never checked those. I'll take some iron and another iron sword and some bread. That's good. Why not? Am I doing on cobble? I'm doing okay. Alright. Where is the... Oh, here it is. I'll just take this bed and end this video. Uh... Thank you for watching, and there will be more Hardcore Mode Flat World Challenge to come in the, the near future.